We have Rachel here with Luxury Daily. Rachel, what do you think luxury marketers can learn from this study? So there have been a lot of studies, um, you know, some are monthly, some are annual, some are just kind of, um, you know, taking up specific uh, time periods, and I feel like there's a lot of mixed messaging out there. Um, you know, some are saying that affluent consumers are ready to spend again, and others are saying that they're not ready to spend, and, um, you know, they're hesitant about financial security. Um, and I know, I, th I feel like even though, you know, despite the state of the economy, um, affluent consumers are still, you know, just kind of nervous in general. Um, so I feel like the main message that luxury brands need to get is that, um, you know, you need to keep maintaining client relationships. You need to keep, um, you know, putting your advertising dollars out there. You need to keep focusing on the things that make you a luxury brand, like quality, um, craftsmanship, and heritage, and look, um, legacy, etc. Um, and I feel like those are the most important things because, um, you know, the economy will go up and down, and it will go up and down for a long time. Um, and I feel like as long as consumers um, and brands have a specific and special relationship, then consumers will um, continue to buy that brand despite their, um, you know, despite their economics. Great, thank you.